Right, this is just going to be a quick video for the um, glasses wearers um, among you. Um, quite often when people talk about goggles or do goggles reviews, um, there's always lots of people sort of commenting that they have to wear box goggles because they wear glasses and, and stuff like that. Um, and for a long time, I've used my Skyzone, um, I think, what are these, um, V02S um, V+. Plus. Or should I say 02S V plus um, and these are basically the goggles that Ladrib um, used until very recently um, he's got a review on them um, and I've changed mine slightly so I've removed this standard um, faceplate put on a fat shark faceplate um, basically just to add the fan and these have got a newbie drawn um, comfort fat shark um, foam pad around them which um, is really nice um, but recently uh, or should I say what I've tend to do with mine is I just take some old glasses lenses and stick them inside with a bit of 3m foam tape um, but recently I lost my lenses I took them out um, misplaced them um, and couldn't find them so what I've been doing is sticking my ginormous sunglasses prescription lenses inside like so and as you can see it just doesn't work at all and i can't really see much um, when i'm flying um so i've got some new specs recently so all i've done is remove the lenses from them and I'm, this is basically one of the lenses and then all you want to do before you remove the lens is just put a little mark as to where your eyeball um, naturally looks straight ahead and in my case the mark would have been about here um, and all I've basically done is cut straight along that mark which has then given me two lens pieces which I can then use to fit inside the goggles um, and the reason for doing this is while I could go out and get some prescription RHO lenses or lenses of those type basically the lenses that you can buy specifically for fat shark goggles or sky zones um, because I've got a relatively heavy astigmatism they are about 150 quid in my case um, because most people like myself have got an old set of glasses lying around um, do yourself a favor and spend that 150 quid um, elsewhere and I thought I'd stop what I was doing and quickly just show you what I've done so basically all I've done is split the lenses in two um, and these lenses these days if you've got modern lenses are made out of some polymer or plastic um, and they're really really easy to cut with a hacksaw and because the all the goggles whether you've got fat shark or skies on um, come with these little covers so you can get diopters if you wish to do so which basically slide in there all you basically need to do is essentially just cut a chunk of your glasses lens to roughly the same size it doesn't even have to be accurate in the slightest and all you basically do is just push it into the slot and as I said it doesn't have to be accurate um, even as rough, as rough as that I can't see the lens at all all I can see is a perfectly clear um, goggle image and this is the other half of the lens and essentially all i'm going to do is just put that one in the other side even though they don't fit perfectly i can just put a blob of glue um, just to hold them steady inside the slots so all i'm going to do now basically is well you can either cut along here just to make them a bit shorter um, and just use a hacksaw or just get a file and because these things are plastic um, two minutes rubbing on a file will just take away all this excess so basically all I'm going to do is just file it until about there where my finger is and that'll be job done all right so I've filed them down uh, I probably need to file this one a little bit more um, because this one's slightly slimmer because I've just basically made two out of one it doesn't fit in perfectly but all I need to do is just add a blob of glue here or a bit of foam tape it's cost me nothing at all and should for whatever reason I ever damage these lenses I've got a spare one to use right so I've clipped the faceplate black back on 
I've put a little bit of double sided fawn tape at either side just to keep the lenses in place and I've tried them and I can see absolutely fine so all I'm going to do now as a finishing touch is just unclip my face plate again I'm just going to take some uh, get some basically black insulation tape and just cover up the unsightly bits um, all I've done as I said is I put um, double sided 3M foam tape just to hold the lenses and then I've just run insulation tape around the lenses and across the middle um, just in case they come loose um, the tape will just stop them from uh, from falling apart and then just clipped the fat short face plate back on again um, and it works absolutely brilliantly so there you go saved myself 150 quid and I've got a backup lens should I ever need them cheers guys thanks bye bye